whose man's is this? I don't know, and, and I'm not even mad, but I'm like, where do you, you derive your authority to have that much commentary at that volume about this culture? Where did you participate? What did you produce? Who did you help to produce the works in this culture? And if you can't qualify, then I don't have to listen to what you're saying and stop trying to push these people, hold on, on our communities as the authorities on these things. Furthermore, create beauty. Because all of that, these motherfuckers create laws and traffic and tension. They don't create anything beautiful that you can fucking use to create energy in your life so that you can be beautiful and try to survive this mess that we're fucking in. And at the risk of sounding like the dude in the network, it's a different fucking time, human beings. Right? It's not a joke. It's not a movie. It's not an episode of a telenovela. We're in a new motherfucking wild world, and you're going to have to be committed and vigilant to being beautiful and sincere in whatever way that you can. And, it's my, and I won't continue with the sermon, but to quote you, Dave, it is a kindness conspiracy. It don't right. matter what the governments do with these cornball, competitive, bullshit Olympics about power, what happens in these arenas. Be good to the good people. Don't kiss nobody's ass. And enough with the shenanigans. And if you make art that has a large audience, even a small audience, just be fucking truthful and beautiful. Come on, man, stop making it goofy and ugly and cynical.